Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to create a pop-up in Revolution Slider 6.0. Let me show you what we are going to do here. So if you click on the menu item, oh, menu can pop up. Click away, just like that. So I'm going to show you how I did that here. So how it works is uh, I've got this pop-up here. That I created. Now what this is is a group and it's got different items inside. It's got a background. This this background we can uh, we can style that however we want. So we want it like a, a blue color. Okay, it doesn't, doesn't matter. And these are just uh, text items. Now these can be uh, these could actually be buttons if we wanted to add like a button. we say menu item one and then we can style that however we want to style it but let's say we want to take away you know the border or something like that um, what we can then do is we can I like to center them in the screen and then I add them to the groups by dragging below and then I can Center it, and then I can put it wherever I want. Let's, let's delete some of these. Let's delete some text there, and we'll just make it a bunch of buttons. Duplicate that. Drag it up. Center it. Duplicate. Center it. It doesn't really matter. Okay, so we've got this pop-up here, named it pop-up 01. Now, uh, for the menu, this is uh, for the button, the menu button, this is where we're going to add our actions. So I'll delete that. So what we do is, this is how it looks when you first uh, come into the actions. You want to click on simple link, simple link or um, you could do uh, you could also, sorry, simple link. You can also do hover, mouse enter, mouse leave, stuff like that. I'm going to do a click. The action is not, sorry, it's not a simple link. It's a toggle first slash last frame. And we're going to do the pop up. And it's going to, the pop is going to, the pop up is going to be untoggled to start off with. And we're going to keep the last state. Okay. So on click, it will. Toggle the first and last frame of pop-up one. Okay, so let's see if that worked. Save that. And then I'm going to preview it if it will ever finish saving. There we go. All right, so we got our menu button, and this could be anything. This could be like any image or whatever you want. Just click on it, boom, pops up, pops away. And then these are buttons too, so if you want to click on those, they can take you wherever you want. You just have to add actions to that. So that's a quick, simple way to add a pop-up in Revolution Slider. So hope, hope it helps.